Hey guys, what is up? Hope everyone is doing well. Hope everyone's having an amazing day because I am as usual. And ladies and gentlemen, we have something important to talk about, okay? So, as many of you know, um, the exchange hotbed has run into some deep trouble, okay? Big, big things uh, happened. A lot of you had your bone stake there. And, uh, you know, it seemed like at one point you'd never see your bone again. And uh, obviously that caused a lot of anger, upset. Uh, people were just kind of counting on the fact that they'd never see their bone again. And this all happened due to some, you know, financial fraud that one of the employees in Hotbit uh, was involved in. And uh, that, uh, well, prompted the, the government to investigate the exchange and um, a lot of the activity was suspended until further notice and that caused a massive massive chaos uh, because a lot of people are holding their assets cryptos uh, so they have a lot of money and uh, obviously if it's frozen it sucks it pretty much sucks that's that's how i would define it and uh, you know uh, time time would obviously tell because the investigation would have to be carried out uh, probably all the employees got investigated uh, but it turns out that there was one person involved in some corruption now still things haven't gotten back into full action but I think uh, the authorities obviously realized that mm, they can't keep on <clears throat> uh, freezing everything locking everything because it's going to create panic and last thing that uh, they want or need is panic. So someone asked a very interesting uh, question, well, or made an in interesting point on Reddit. And I thought it would be interesting if we could go into it. Now, possible short term dump for bone and cards. So many people are holding their bones on Hotbit. Hotbit probably will be opened in this week as bone withdraws um, 30 bones. Most of the holders might sell it first to convert it to other tokens and withdraw and then buy it somewhere else. Any dump would be a good uh, buying opportunity. So let's see what the people have to respond to it. Only buying dips over here. I'm with you 100%. Since bone minting has stopped, I should imagine investors are withdrawing from the liquidity pool and staking then cashing in some bone. Personally, I withdrew from the liquidity pool and bought some more bone with the Ethereum. I know the potential of bone in liking this dip this aged well suckers hotbit has not restored yet so we need to see this week by the way i'm not against bone my entry point is 0.5 odd cents the more bone moves the better thief you stole my comment okay <clears throat> so not that many comments out there but still quite interesting i think uh, what it's gonna create uh when it goes back 100 percent into action you know because I think they will resume the activity once everything has been investigated, found out. The fines that are supposed to be given out will be given out. And then they can resume their activity. I think a lot of people are just going to, uh, you know, start withdrawing uh, a lot of their bones, selling, whatever it is. But it's going to cause a lot of uh, movement. And movement can have a massive impact on the price, undoubtedly. Could have a short-term impact. But uh, once things are clear, I think everyone is just going to queue up to, um, you know, withdraw their bone because uh, they kind of lost the faith, I guess, in Hotbit. Hotbit, uh, by, by having these type of issues like um, frozen, frozen cryptos, assets and all that, uh, it completely damages the reputation. Remember, remember all these exchanges they uh, drive, they thrive on reputation. It's crucial for them. The reason why you invest or you put your money somewhere is because they can provide you the, the well, basically the, the evidence uh, that they will keep it safe, okay? Uh, so they have this encouragement and you feel uh, safe. You have this safety with the exchange or whatever, if it's a bank, so you need that. You don't want to be there risking your money and being scared and nervous every day that it could disappear. Now, this is what Hotbit completely ruined, okay, for itself, is this confidence, this comfort that people could, are supposed to feel, the investors. That's why they won't trust it and they're going to be moving their cryptos to other, other exchanges. 
Mm, and uh, I think uh, there's going to be a lot of movement you're going to see. And that's probably going to affect the price either way. I think it's going to drop the price because uh, you're going to see a lot of also sell-offs. Um, but remember, it's all short term. At the end of the day, it will all correct itself. And we're expecting massive developments like Shibarium, other big exchanges, listing bone, uh, more social media attention. Uh, well, less less of it in circulation and more demand. So all this stuff is going to boost up the price. But there will be one or two days where you are going to see a big, big movement. So you don't freak out, please. Any big, I mean, it could drop a dollar, and a dollar is a lot for Bone at the moment. That's like wiping out 50% of its value, considering the fact that it could be floating around two dollars right now. But you should never panic because. Um, you know, even though the price can go down at some point, it will, okay, it will provide you with a buying opportunity. And we and that's something that we all need as well. Because uh, some of you have been late, some people didn't load up on their bags as much as they would have liked to. So all these are amazing opportunities to load up, to buy as much as you need, uh, if, if the price goes down. But if not, then perfect. We're all motivated. We're all on the same pathway. But I think Hotbit is definitely, definitely going to have an effect. Okay, I don't know if it's going to be like a major, major one or, or a minor one. But uh, there might be an effect uh, on it. So um, take that into account. Hopefully it doesn't happen with any other exchanges and people don't have to face any losses or any problems uh, because you know I, I feel bad for the general person that just is trying to make a few bucks on the side or is genuinely trying to change their lifestyle their wealth uh, they shouldn't have to go through these all these problems that um, uh, have nothing to do with them okay so um, ladies and gentlemen for you not to miss out on any information make sure you subscribe like share this video be part of the community don't forget okay I'm producing a lot of information um you know trying to find out any topic i can talk about uh, so you are engaged motivated uh because your engagement is key to the to your success and also to the to my success because um i want to keep on being motivated and producing more videos so if i see you get engaged i'm gonna do more even more research um uh, so yeah and if you have any thoughts please leave them down below in the comment section let's talk about it Let's discuss, let's figure out where Bone is going. How is it gonna impact, how is Hotbit gonna impact Bone? If you have any thoughts, please leave them down below in the comment section. Most importantly, I wanna say a big thank you to everyone. Appreciate all the support and I'll see you in my next video.